Hello, hello. Welcome back to Common Sense Crypto Channel, where we're creating a community of like-minded individuals who use common sense. Before we begin, I just want to explain to you, I have a QR code right down here somewhere. And if you scan it with your phone, it will take you to this form, which is for a free 15-minute crypto discovery session with me where you can ask me anything crypto. We can discuss how to get started on your crypto journey or if you have questions regarding something that you're doing and you're unsure about or something that you want to do and I'm not sure how to do it. So all you do is you just fill out your name, first name, last name, email address, and your phone number. Check off if you prefer for me to contact you by email or cell phone. <clears throat> and we, I will contact you to set up your 15-minute discovery session by phone. You can also put in the subject of something that you want to discuss, whether it's just starting out crypto, don't know where to begin, or setting up a wallet, or whatever it may be. If you're not sure how to use a QR code, the link is in the description below. I just put it there because I thought it would be pretty simple and easy just to scan it and fill out the form. Today, talk about Redcoin. Redcoin has updated their site and they have a really a lot of cool things on it. They have how and where, not how, but they have where you can buy Redcoin now. I know a few months ago, I tried to buy Redcoin and I did not, could not find places to buy it. There was a couple of exchanges I found it on, but you needed a KYC and they were in different countries, so I could not do that. So this is pretty cool because it shows you different exchanges to buy it on, which most of those do have a KYC. So there's Bitcoin.com, Bitvago, actually they don't have that, sorry, Bitmart, Bittrex, CoinSpot. Frey Exchange, which Frey Exchange, they don't require a KYC. I know that for a fact. I've used them before. Some swap exchanges. Most of these do not require a KYC. Change Angel. Um, Coin Switch. InstaSwap. Shapeshift. They do require a KYC to buy and trade. And a few others. That's about it for that one, in case you wanted to buy some red coin. Also on their site, which I'm really excited about, they have Redbot, or yes, Redbot, I believe it's called. Yes, and where you can tip users red coin on social media, Twitter, Reddit, Twitch, Telegram, and Discord. You can integrate Redbots into your live Twitch streams or chat groups on Telegram and Discord. Right now I'm going to show you how to enable it on Twitter. I just did this before. It was really simple. I'm going to leave the link in the description for the article where it tells you exactly how to do this. It's not, it's not hard. It's really not hard. You have to follow at Tip Redcoin on Twitter in order to enable this, okay? And it works through entering commands, uh, messaging them commands to see your wallet address, to see how much you have in your wallet, and also to send Redcoin to different people on tw uh, Twitter, not Twitch, Twitter, <laughs> okay? So you just have to go over to Twitter and find Redcoin RDD Tipbot. Let me get the article so I'm telling you to do correctly. What am I doing here? Okay. So you just do this. You fought you have to follow tip Redcoin, and then they'll immediately send you a follow request which you need to accept. Doing so will create you your account and your Redcoin address. And then three, Tipcoin will then reply to you in a public tweet to inform you of the success of your registration. 
And if you want to get more information, you type in plus info in the command line. And when you do that, it'll send you a notification of your red coin address, of the coin, the deposit address, and your balance. You need at least 10 red coin in your wallet to be able to send a tip to people. There's other commands that they have as well, which is listed here. Okay, sign up, <clears throat> it's plus register, the view commands, uh, plus info. This is on Twitter, Reddit, Twitch for Telegram. It's, it's a little different. To view your balance, plus balance. And, and you can type all these commands into, on Twitter, well, this, I'm just, Speaking just of Twitter right now, uh, you just message them, type in the command, and it'll pop up the information that you're looking for. Again, it's really simple. It's simple, it's easy, it's great. This is wonderful because now this is really going to get red coin out there to the masses, the public, and, and they can see how simple it is to, to use this. I think. A big problem, big problems with different crypto projects is that it's not easy to interact with, especially for people who are not really involved in crypto, don't know much about crypto. So the easier it is to interact with it, to use it, to get your hands onto it, the more it's going to get into the general population and grow. And people are going to start integrating it into their own personal lives. Lastly, Redcoin is going to be at DevCon this, this Friday. It starts the 6th through the 8th. They were invited to speak. They're doing a hackathon. Let's find out where exactly it says that. Hold on. Um, Hold on a second. Okay, Redcoin is hosting an AMA about DEF CON that was on yesterday. But they're going to be at DEF CON, uh, the Blockchain Village Educational Track. So I think that's great because they were, they were invited to be there. They didn't you know, say, I want to be there. They were invited to be there. They're doing, like I said, a hackathon. Yeah, I will leave this link in the description below so you guys can find out more information about it. Redcoin is hosting, okay, I just read that. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll leave a link in the description below for the DEF, here we go, BTC and at Redcoin. I hope that DEF CON will be great growth opportunity for the project. They're really coming along. If some projects are, stand out more than others in the media, Redcoin is one, they have media and they're, they're slowly, getting more out there in the media and I think a lot more people know about it than um, a lot more people know about it but they're slowly having more and more media coverage on them and I think personally that being able to use it and tip on Twitter, Twitch, Telegram and Discord and stuff like that is really going to get Redcoin in more people's faces. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this gave you guys some great information. Please like, please subscribe, share this video, and comment below if you guys have any questions trying to sign up to be enabled tipping for yourself or to tip other people on Twitter, and I can help you out. And that's it. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you guys are involved with Redcoin at all. And I will see you guys in the next video. And don't, rem don't forget to... If you want a free 15-minute crypto discovery session, scan the QR code or link is in the description below as well. And that's it. I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, bye.